Okay, we're back to talent school today. Let's talk about the world of ed entertainment. I'm doing entertainment, by the way. So when you look at this movie, the bandwagon, because I mean, I knew Ava Gardner when I saw her, but I see credits going to Sid Cherise, and I'm like, but I know doggone well there's Ava Gardner. So you know me, I do a little bit of that BET, vetting. Light song, light song. Light song, light song. I know, I'm just messing with you. Tis the season. But yeah. Da, 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 da. I know I'm going to get, I know I'm monetized, but I don't know who owns this stuff. Does Russia own our stuff? I don't know. Why does it, well, you know what? I'm not monetized, so it doesn't matter. But the point of the matter is, there's, since we're talking entertainment today, you see 50 million people going, including Ava Gardner, going uncredited, by the way, which means they didn't get any credit in the movie cast. So if you saw the movie scrolling through, if you went to the movies, and even if you look at the end of this, you don't see their uh, names come up. Why? Because they're uncredited. Do you know what uncredited means? It means you were in the movie, but you didn't get, you didn't get paid a damn thing. Now, that's why if you wonder how you have all these, like the Ten Commandments or whatever, you got 50 billion people in it. People who just want to be famous. They just want to be famous. They just want to be in the scene. Here's the thing, though. Some people get paid. Some don't. You know what I mean? Be careful with what you say. You just want not Ava Gardner. Shit, she got money. She had money, so they got her to do this thing because you know what? Maybe she was just doing it for a friend. Because if you were a friend or a friend of a friend and stuff, something like that, and you wanted the movies to pop off, and you knew, you know, you already knew you were boss in your own right, and then maybe you had some like little label issues, like you know, your friend worked at one label, but you worked at another label, and the, you can't, you can't be in this. But I like it. I like the script and I like the movie. But still, you know, it's that loyalty. So it's like, okay, well, I'll just come in, make a quick little scene, say hi, and just let it be. And I don't get no money. Unless it's under the table. That's another thing. But no, but uh, but you don't get credited, yo. He does look like Peter Capaldi. What was his name? Jeffrey. Jeffrey Cordova, the guy that played Jeffrey. Good. I know I got to think about Peter Capaldi, one of my favorite doctors indeed. Who, Doctor Who? Ugh. I, I the the rest the, the new ones that's that's for y'all that's that's not for me. Oh uh, my doctor my doctor who era apparently is overseas, but thank God for reruns and stuff like this that I can go back and watch for free. Sit back and eat popcorn and just be me. But that's it. A lot of people got credited. You can have fifty billion people. I mean literally. I mean literally. And you wonder how did they all get paid? They didn't. But you have to research and research, and so I, that's what I was doing today. I was like, because I knew that was Ava Gardner, but when you go into the main credits, you don't see her. And I'm like, she came up literally first in the first five minutes of the scene. What do you mean she's not in the damn thing? But she is in the damn thing, but she goes uncredited because of the money. See the money See the money thing that they played back in the day? They're still playing it too today. Some of y'all like our, like Otis Blackwell. He only got $25 for those Elvis Presley records that he wrote. That Elvis Presley actually stole. Elvis Presley stole a lot of stuff. That's why Elvis loved black people. Don't necessarily blame Elvis Presley for that. Blame Listen, they killed Elvis too. That's what the industry will do. Elvis actually liked people. Oh, he loved him so much he took everything you did. <laughs> he wanted to be black too. Everybody wants to be a nigga, but nobody wants to be a nigga. And the industry teaches treats everybody like niggas today. Like your government, okay, or all the governments, the leaders, okay. Listen, you have soldiers who know exactly what I mean. It's like, what the fuck? I know. Now do you see what I mean? Some of you do. Ain't fun when your own country or your own leaders start to nigger out you. Slave, slave master, and troublemaker. Which one are you? I'm a teacher. <clears throat> That's it. But it's not. Have a nice day. Who do you think I am? More importantly, what am I to you?